So here's an idea I just thought up. I'll call it a Bluetooth cassette. So all you need is one of these cassettes that has a headphone jack that would connect to your cell phone that outputs the audio to your car's audio. And in this case, a Bluetooth headset and a Bluetooth transceiver, USB style. So I can output audio from my PC. All right, let's see what I can do. All right, so I opened up the cassette adapter and here are the inputs that would normally connect to your cell phone. So I'll need to remove those three and connect the speaker output of the Bluetooth headset to ground and to the right. Okay. Okay, now here's the Bluetooth headset. This is where the speaker connects to the circuit board. The black or the negative of the speaker already detached while I was opening it. So all I need to do is remove the positive and then attach some leads to those two contacts. Okay, so here are some leads I removed from some phone cable. It's threaded copper. The gauge is a little higher than what I would like to use, but it will do for this. And I did tin the wires before soldering. Okay, so that's good enough for this. And now the entire circuit board and battery will come out of the enclosure. Okay, so here's the cassette now. I have clipped out some pieces of plastic which were used as spacers just so I could fit the Bluetooth module inside and I have connected right to right and ground to ground so let me just cap this thing back together and see if it works okay so here's the cassette I drilled a small hole here so I can turn it on and off using a pencil so let me go ahead and do that okay now you should be able to see that there is a blue light flashing inside there telling you that it has an active link with the source And let me just go ahead and pop the cassette into the cassette player. And press play. Right now it's just static because I don't have anything playing on my computer. So I'm playing the amp hour here. Who needs a chip printer when you can design your own big signal chips on your desktop? Via Designer is a Windows-based software for the design and simulation of analog and digital circuits. And you could also use it to play music. So I will admit the quality isn't perfect, but it does work pretty well. So I did attempt to use my phone to play audio to this and unfortunately it didn't work because for some reason cell phones don't allow you to play music to a Bluetooth headset. They're only really going to play music to a uh, Bluetooth audio gateway I believe they're called. You can buy them. They don't have batteries like a Bluetooth headset does but the audio quality is much better. So you can possibly fit one of those inside a cassette. I'm not sure how big they are exactly. But yeah, feel free to build on my idea. Thanks for watching.